When March rolls around, many ski areas turn to special events to spice things up on the slopes, but nobody's got a better lineup than they do here at Whiteface in New York. It's called Springfest, and it includes weekends dedicated to Mardi Gras, St. Patrick's Day, and reggae. There's music, barbecues, great ticket deals, but most importantly, Whiteface's 85 trails on the greatest vertical drop in the east. The North Country got off pretty easily in the early week storm and conditions are still outstanding overall. Stowe, Smugs and Jay Peak all netted snow on Monday and their surface snow remains very playable, including the glades. The sunniest runs will be the best bets this weekend at Bolton Valley, Mad River and Killington where the groomers have had a very busy week. West Mountain will host the New York Special Olympians on Saturday. They're looking good and you can see the quality of the snow here at Whiteface. The eastern township stayed north of any weather trouble on Monday and you'll still find plenty of packed powder at Mount Sutton and Owl's Head. The Laurentians got all snow and nearly 10 inches of it at Mont saint Sever, Mont Olympia and Mont Gabriel. Check out the new high-speed chair now at Edelweiss. They got more than a half a foot Monday, as did Moran Heights and Montevilla. Mont St. Anne checked in with 11 inches of fresh snow. Stoneham got nine, while between six and eight inches fell at the Balsams in New Hampshire. Out west, the conditions are simply superb at Sun Valley, Snowbird, and Jackson Hole. Temperatures on the slopes of the east will be comfortable this weekend from the Carolinas to Quebec. I'm Herb Stevens, a skiing weatherman.